KUAM News Storm Tracker Updates, presented by McDonald's of Guam, Pacific Solar, Atkins Kroll, Calvo's Insurance, and Docomo Pacific. Hafiday, I'm Jolene Tovis. So far, so good for Guam Power Authority and the Guam Water Works Authority, as both utilities report no major problems at this time. According to spokesperson Heidi Ballendorf, while the power did go out for a few places earlier, they have they were quickly restored. Now keep in mind that we are still in condition of readiness one, and the closest point of approach for Typhoon Dolphin is expected at 6 p.m. Now, if your power does end up going out, you can contact Trouble Dispatch. If you see any down lines, stay away from them. And if you have to use your generator, make sure your generator is placed in a very well ventilated area as the fumes can cause medical problems. Tune in tonight to prime time and keep it tuned in to the stations of KUAM throughout the day for the latest information on Typhoon Dolphin. Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm Jolene Tovez. KUAM News Storm Tracker Updates, presented by McDonald's of Guam, Pacific Solar, Atkins Kroll, Calvo's Insurance, and Docomo Pacific.